because I'm looking at my list now and every, everything's covered. Where I haven't got stuff covered is for the 30th. We have got lots of teams just not got nobody to play yet. They've got to get back to me. Um, I could send him your details if you want. And you can give him a quick. His name's Loxford. On a Sunday morning, it's pretty much a routine. Um, obviously, I get up, I drive to football. I tend to go to the supermarket up the road to buy um, biscuits and tea for the referees. When I get to the venue, I try to get there at least an hour and a half early so I can get in the right mindset of when Mad Rush comes in. When I first came into the marshes and it had a real grassroots effect to it, um, you know, uh, cow sheds, you know, troughs, the old stuff was still there, like kind of thing, you know, and um, you know, you had to come out the change room, walk outside to get to the showers and all that kind of thing. You got to meet a lot of teams on a friendly basis as well. So the Hackney Marsh has always been uh, a friendly environment and social environment as well as just a competitive environment. I would tend to get to my game last. <laughs> I need to make sure the refs are here, everything's fine, they've all gone out, then I'll go to refing my game. Now, because I know that the teams that I'm refing, um, I'm not really expecting any problems. And I think as a referee, you can't really go into a game thinking, oh, I remember that player last time. You've got to be impartial at all times and be professional. Point to the hand that you think the pen's in. Um, as a friend, we can have kick off and stuff. Yeah, we'll take it. Yeah. Let's go! Gina's coming! Gina's coming! Run on, run on, run on, run on, run on! Okay, let's go. Yeah. Open one! Come, 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 What's complex about grassroots football uh, nowadays is, is, is funding, you know, pitch fees have to be paid for, referees have to be paid for, there's a lot of people out of work. As a league, we try our best to keep um, fines down to, to ease the burden on these clubs because what I've noticed, almost 100% of clubs that's left the league has left due to funding. Either the players that they have can't afford to, to play, which means the secretary or the manager ends up taking out their own pocket and they can't do that forever. And we as a league um, find it very hard to uh, balance it out that teams can keep on playing football but without going into debt. In the FA need to do more, um, but again, we need to look at what does the FA deem to be grassroots football? Because if they're going to be putting in 3G pitches for a certain level of football, um, you know, people that play on the Hackney Marsh, that's not going to benefit them because one, they're not going to be able to afford to play on 3G pitches and, you know, this is grassroots, this is all about grass. Stand there and you look at the marshes and you look at the, the beautiful surroundings. Um, of the marshes, all the trees, and then you've got the football going on. 
you know, you, you can see true, true beauty there. It'd be very hard to contemplate what I'll be doing if there was no marshes to be honest with you because it's such a unique venue and it's not a venue I could I would want to lose. This is the team that I played for, which was Salisbury FC. Um, this photo was taken in 97, 98 season. Um, that's me there, a lot slimmer than, than I am now. Those days, you understood what being um, sponsored by a pub was all about. Because every Sunday, every player went back to the pub um, and um, that was funded by. We had food, um, had social activities going on, you know, and, and we drank and things like that. And I think that's... Um, one of the downsides of today's uh, football where if you're being sponsored by a pub not everybody goes back to the pub and it's very difficult for a pub to sponsor a team if the team's not going back to the pubs. What we're doing in Hackney and Leighton Football League now is we're looking to get involved with the youth football with Hackney Council and therefore um, help develop uh, youngsters and their coaches um, to improve their players and, and, and obviously run into the clubs as well. You know, seeing these kids really enjoying themselves playing football on a Sunday, scoring goals and, and all that, you know, it's it's such a, it's, it gives you a new type of buzz, a new injection to um, to carry on trying to improve grassroots football. Right the <laughs> My name is Jermaine Wright. I am the fixture secretary and the referee secretary for the Hackney and Leighton Sunday Football League.